what is your scent of the day? Mine is Absolute Aventus by Creed. If you want to hear more about this fragrance and also um, how it compares to the original um, Aventus, then uh, please uh, stay tuned. Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Orlando and on this channel we talk about fragrances and a very warm, warm welcome if this is your first time tuning in. So yes, today we are talking about Absolute Aventus by Creed and this is my scent of the day. Uh, I have had it for a while but uh, I've kind of been trying it out a bit more uh, recently and uh, so um, yeah, I've been giving it some full wearings just to see about um, longevity and uh, stuff like that, how it performs. So I'm just going to show you the uh, presentation as well. So it comes on um, this very nice uh, box now. It's much nicer presentation than before and also it just kind of slides into place there. So that's how um, it comes and it doesn't really close so the um the cup is now metal cup so that is they're quite heavy uh in comparison to previous events there were there were plastic cups i think these days they all come with uh, a metal cup but still the boxes are i think i still like this one kind of uh, just a paper box i much prefer the new uh presentation you know of the um uh, absolute event so it's a much premium uh, kind of box um, so yeah um, so that's presentation out so I'm just gonna do a fresh spray here to see how this smells so with this one as soon as you spray to get this blast of citruses and so the citrus and then a kind of a so it's it's very uh, citrusy forward uh, uh, as as when you first uh, spray it and then you start to get uh, some um uh, spices coming through uh like um cardamom and there's also um the cinnamon note that um, it's very kind of nice and um, slightly sweet here so it gives this warmth to the, the fragrance so it's kind of uh, um, it's very interesting because even though you can um, detect the cinnamon it's it's a very very soft um, note here but it you definitely detect it and it's, but it's so smooth and so kind of warming and uh, slightly sweet but you do get the fr the, some fruit uh, here too, uh, especially the citruses, the black currant as well. It's quite kind of a uh, quite prominent here, and you also get um, uh, some people say that you don't uh, really have pineapple in this fragrance, but I can I, I detect that too. So it's uh, to me this smells very similar to the original Aventus, but a much kind of warmer stronger much denser version of it really because well um, the uh, the original event is, is more i find more of a, a light airy uh, fragrance is more like very citrus is uh, citrus forward and it's only i find it kind of airy and very light in a way well this one it's got more uh, body to it is more it's denser it's um sweeter if you I like I it's definitely a sweeter fragrance but at the same time it's refreshing so that's what I like about this is very nice it's very uh, it's kind of sweet denser but uh, refreshing at the same time so I would say this is more like a spring summer fragrance as Aventus is but it's you can hear uh, can wear it all year round because it works really well um, so it's very refined um, fragrance I mean um, for me it's it's a winner it's a very nice uh, i really like it um but again aventus has always been uh, one of my favorite fragrances of all time in fact aventus is the first fragrance 
the first niche fragrance I've, I've ever bought and uh, I fell in love with it really and I went through a 75 mil one because I used to come in 75 mil and 120 I still have one of my 120 ones here as you can see um, this one um, they don't come in this size anymore but as you can see this one is kind of it's got like a slightly um, green um, tint to it while the newer ones are more um, kind of uh, clear uh, things so uh, I don't know if is um, if it's with age that it's gone this color but I I remember being already slightly tinted uh, but maybe not this green um, but yeah and this one it, it's kind of it's always been a smokier one of the smokier batches of it because I think with with the vintage you have different batch variations and this one has always been a smokier one in my opinion you still get the the um the you know the citrus is uh opening but i think it's lost a bit of that uh, maybe with age and this it's kind of more smoky and um you know you kind of get more of the base uh notes with it now but it's still a very nice uh fragrance and uh to me this is like one of the best it's very very long lasting this one um this one is a 2019 one sorry this one is a 2016 this is 2019 so the liquid is um clearer and um and this one to me it's fruitier so it's it's, it's a fruitier version it is not as smoky as the other one um still it's i i i don't think it's as long lasting as this one but it, it's still okay, it's still uh, performing really well. And then I also have a 10 mil here one. I think this is a 2013 one, at least this is when I got it from um, Cree Direct. And this again, it's more of a, a citrusy forward uh, one. It's not very um, uh, strong, so it's a very light fragrance. I mean, in comparison to um, Absolute Aventus, this is like, it, it, it feels like more of a eau de toilette or eau de cologne while this one is more of a eau de parfum so yeah um that is um uh, my take on it really i as if you're wondering which one uh, i prefer i would th i would say it's absolute aventus because it's it's stronger it's it's got more um more of a development is more of, more of a character you know i kind of i prefer it because it's 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 nice I, I i kind of lean more towards uh sweet uh, you know fresh sweet scents and this is this is more uh, like that having said that i still really like the aventus the original i mean i mean this the 2016 one is really really good um to be honest i really enjoy that so this um, one is also quite nice the 2019 one um, but I think they probably will get slightly stronger with age because this one, the 2023 one, is the the lighter of all of them. But I think it's because it's newer. I don't know. So I'm also expecting that maybe this one will get even stronger with age. Uh, but as of now, I think it's a, an amazing fragrance. And um, yeah. Uh, so um, let me just get you the notes for these fragrances as well um i mean they're very similar so with the normal event as you get uh, a stop notes you have lemon pink pepper apple bergamot and black currant as the uh, mid you get pineapple jasmine and patchouli the base you get birch and broxan cedarwood oak moss and musk so i would say that my 2016 one it's kind of uh, you get uh, it's got uh, it's got a lot of birch because it's um it's kind of very uh, a bit smoky or more smoky than the other one so i think you get that smokiness from the birch and then with the absolute aventus you have for top notes you have bergamot lemon black currant grapefruit and ginger so very similar notes but uh slightly different you have ginger rather than apple and this one uh for the hard notes you have pineapple patchouli pink pepper 
and cardamom and cinnamon therefore you get these spices here that you don't get on the original one so the the pepper the cardamom the cinnamon kind of give this uh the spiciness to it and then for the base you have vetiver cashmere and wood labdan and, and broxen musk and okmo so i think you get this kind of smooth warm and sweetness also from the cashmere and uh, wood and this one and it's just uh, really uh, phenomenal I really like it so they kind of share a very similar uh, nights the 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 two of them and I would say this is a uh, very um, you, you can tell it's an Aventus um, it's an Aventus cologne because it's it's quite uh, similar to the to the original but in a much as I said much you know much stronger much much warmer and a deeper version of it so yeah so that is my take on absolute Aventus by uh, creed um so have you guys tried this fragrance uh, if you have please leave your comments down below tell me what you think about it awesome. and uh, if you have uh, enjoyed this uh, review please uh, give this video a thumbs up and also please consider to subscribe to my channel i hope to see you in my next one and thank you so much for watching bye bye